M0FXB, welcome to my videos on the Yesu FT4XE dual band VHF, UHF and broadcast frequencies radio. M0FXB, let's add a repeater to our Yesu FT4XE. So, turn it off, turn it on. Now it's showing A here, so this button toggles you from A band to B band and then to memory mode. We're just going to stay on the A and then input the frequency of your repeater, the output frequency or the fre frequency that you listen on. So one, four, five, let's do seven, five, zero, which is GB3 BC. So the first thing, do you want to use automatic shift? So hold down the function button here with two lines and you can go up and down through the menus with these arrows and look number 29 is automatic repeater shift press that and you and we'll just turn it off for now but if you want it on it will put in the shifts for you we'll just turn it off hit that then let's go down to menu 30 or up to 30 now we want the repeater frequency so we'll hold that down the button here repeater frequency and shift so number 30 press it again briefly and look you've got 600 that's our shift that's fine come out of that now let's go to 31 we've got the repeater shift so press it there and then you can choose minus plus or simplex we want minus that's fine now let's go to number 30 let's go to 36 36 is the squelch type. Just press the function button. Look, tone squelch, tone. So we, we nearly always I choose tone squelch, but tone will work. Tone, then press this, so you've got your squelch on now. Now let's go to, let's set the power to number 40. 40 power, press function button. I've got mine on high because it's a repeater, it's quite far away. So that's fine. So we've got our shift, our frequency. It's all in there now. Hold down the function button to go back onto your normal screen. So what you should be seeing now on here is you've got the minus, the tone squelch turned on and we've set the tone frequency. Let's just double check that we have though actually. That'll be menu 30. So let's hold this down. Let's go down to menu 30 repeater frequency hit the function button again let's hit the function again I th what we're looking for is tone frequency which is 38 there we are right now hit the function now we can select 94.8 which is what it is but you can go up and down if you want a different one look for your repeater this is the receive one at the moment so hit the function and then do it again, 38. At this time, hit the VM button to get it onto TX. So here, VM, and you see a T appear here. And then you can go up and down again, select that. So 94.8, transmit and receive tone frequency. And let's come out, hold down the button. Now we're all set to open up GB3BC. Not sure if we'll get it from here. Don't think we will. So lastly, let's get it in the memory. Right, we've got our repeater in there. So let's get it into the memory. So all you do is just hold down VM, like so. Then use the numeric keyboard to select the lettering. So G is on number four. So we go G, keep pushing it till you get G. Then push the function button to move it across. Then we want B. B, function button, then C, I think actually we want three, so let's do three, GB3, move it along, function button here, GB3, BC, so A, B, move it along, and then C, A, B, C, GB3, BC, and now hold down the VM button here and it will say memory in 
and it will take you back to VFO mode. To go into memory mode, just go, you're on A band, B band, then you're in memory mode. And look, number three is GB3BC. I think we are just about opening it. So anyway, um, yeah, I think just about. <laughs> so and look, we can cycle through our memories. And if we want to scan, we just hold it down. And it will stop when, it, when there's activity. Obviously, there's only three, three memories in there. Thanks for watching. All the best. How to add your memory channel to your Yaesu FT4XE. 7.3, very nice, very nice little radio, very good value this radio, very pleased with that, with it and what you get for your money. 7.3, all the best. M0FXB, quick unboxing of the Yesu FT4X. So why have I got this? Well, it's just such a bargain for uh, 60 pound. I think it was like 64 delivered from Moonraker. And you get a proper Yesu budget radio. I know we've got our Bofungs and lots of other budget stuff lying around. This is the EU model, so I'll just do the unboxing and then we'll be doing lots of videos just showing you how to, to program it. You can use a programming lead, which does not come in the box, um, but I'm just going to do it off the, from the front. You've got a keypad. So, yeah, a proper instruction manual. Looks good. We'll go through that later. And rechargeable battery pack. So it talks about the battery, I guess. And it's quite a, a small, dinky little radio, which I knew that when I purchased it. So let's just uh, slide out the packaging. It's got what they call the trigger sort of micro, uh, PTT, which I would say is a very similar type to the FT70. Now, of course, I highly recommend the FT70, but it's, a, it's three times the price. So here's the, uh, just the comparison of size between the 70 and the you know, the, the 4X, obviously I haven't put the antenna on it yet, but look at the PTT, very similar feel and design to it. So yeah, it's, you know, just, um, it's, it looks very good quality. There's the battery on the back there. I'm pretty sure to get it off, you just slide it over like that. And then it just comes out. It does actually come with a desktop child, but you've got your function button, input for squelch there and um, programming now that looks like speaker mic and programming connector there with a threaded connector on off there emergency I, just, I think if you hold that it just it makes a sound basically and then let's have a look at the the antenna as well i mean they do give good quality boxes don't they yeah so i always keep boxes i, I i'm a bit of a box Freak, to be honest. I always like the box to be in perfect condition. So, uh, yeah, adapter for your mains as required. It's a charging adapter there. So, cool, quite well packaged. Um, charging adapter, I think it's one amp. 12 volts, I'm pretty sure it is. Nice chunky lead there. That's the uh, adapter that you can just slide on. So you don't have to play, play around in the UK. So the old one, you just push that button, slide it up, put that in the box. Who knows, you might need that abroad. And then, um, We'll work it out in a minute. <laughs> I got the right way around. Just one sec. Okay, sussed it. So you go like so. You want the the wider flaps just to be sort of above like that. There you go. See that? Like that. And then it clicks down into place then and, and latches. And I'll just take it off. See that? Clips in, and that's it. So that's that. Then you've got your belt clip with the screws in it. Which I, I do always put belt clips on. Just, I feel like the radio just feels better with them on. Oh, probably lost the screws there, but anyway. The belt clip um, goes here, like so. I'll put that on in a sec, just a couple of screws. It's a nice, nice weight, nice, 
nice size yeah it's a, it's, a, it's a nice looking little device um and then we need the antenna we've got here oh that's a nice very nice chunky solid looking antenna yeah very very i i like that a lot and um, what's someone said the frequencies on it is only for you know 70 centimeters no it does say on there 136 to 174 so that's not true so um maybe it was on one of the other chinese radios these are made in japan by the way um, so that's good looks nice and then we'll get the charger out charging base and that's unusual, isn't it, to actually get a charging base with a radio. And why have they done that? Well, they're trying to compete with both, aren't they? So, which is fine if, if competition makes us get better deals and more things. So there you go. Put that, we're going to put that on charge. And then we're going to be looking at how to program the thing. But I know that you've got a, a function menu here. There you go. Function, there you go, look. It talks to you as well, but we, we don't, we're not going to do that now, but it's a very, I'm very pleased with it. It's a very nice looking little set. 7-3 for now.